Hey, how you all doing? Um, this weekend I got a food saver vacuum sealer at the local farm store. Uh, it was about 70 bucks. It was, it was about 20, 20% off, I think it was. And it was definitely a pretty good must. Um, we got you know, canning jars and whatnot, but we also got a uh, freezer last weekend or the weekend before. Um, so we can put it to good use and use this for that. And I have to can everything. And uh, I'm just going to go through it, show you what's in it, and I'm going to seal something. I'm going to seal some green beans up all the other garden last night. Uh, I'm going to seal some of that. So I just wanted to do an unboxing before I actually open it and everything. I haven't even... <laughs> But uh, I haven't been through it. Um, I opened the box right here like this, but I have not pulled anything off. Um, it's supposed to come with, so this over here, this to come with Game Saver Sports Appliance. Uh, that's probably the same, this vacuum sealer. 11 inch by 10 foot, uh, 28 centimeters by 3 meters. Food saver roll, 8 inch by 10 foot food saver roll, 5 food, food saver bags, or um, 5 food saver bags, yeah. Accessory hose, hose storage, quick start guide, and reference guide. For anybody who doesn't know, the hose storage for the hose is, uh, I don't know, I guess they have little canisters that uh, suck out air and whatnot. I think they also have a, uh, uh, you can, a little connector that you can use for ball jars. But uh, here's a small roll. Here's the next roll. Um, I don't know what those are. I have to look. Sorry guys, I'm not redoing this video. Uh, here's that hose I was talking about. Got one end that goes in, one end that goes into the jar end. That. And, uh, here's the, I would say the gallon and the quart, or maybe just the gallon. It's probably just a gallon. Um, could say we're guys and whatnot. There she is. So good. Like I said, I haven't opened it yet. I just opened the top of the box right here. cord in the bottom. Got some uh, 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 little rubber uh, stand little thing. And open it up. There's the little port for the hose. Um, I was looking around. I went to uh, this, I got this at the farm supply store. And then I went to Meyer. It's like a Walmart for anybody who doesn't know. Um, and it had a, um, it had one that had a cutter right here. And that thing was like $40 more. 
van, forty dollars more than the same model that was forty dollars more at the other store than it was in where we got it. Uh, so uh, we got this for a hundred dollars. It was like a hundred and thirty something for this model at the other store, and then it was like a hundred and like seven seventy seven dollars for the one that had the little uh, cutter, the automatic little cutter that went across here. Yeah, that's nice, but I'm not paying an extra sixty dollars just for a little cutter. So, uh, yeah, I'm gonna have to try this out and uh, pretty self-explanatory. I'll have to go through and read some instructions and whatnot before I use it and uh, see what's going on with this little thing. But uh, so then. There's my new little toy I get to play with. Alright guys, I'm back and I got my bag done. It's got, uh, this is a two and a half quart bowl and it was about halfway full of beans. So, get this thing lined up. A little tree. Press it down so both the ends latch and uh, you might see the cucumber and the uh, jalapeno pepper that are sitting there. There's nine or seven jalapeno peppers and I have about ten cucumbers outside. Alright, so that is done. Um, so I got my peppers. I'm going to have to pickle the peppers this weekend and the cucumbers. So I got a pretty big weekend ahead of me. Pop this out. Pull that out. And it's that easy. And now I'll just date these and I'll put them in the freezer out in the garage and I'll probably do that to just about all my beans and yeah so that's how that works I'm pretty impressed I like it I definitely like it and uh, yeah so for, you, you can't go wrong with this definitely keeps stuff fresh I also left about three inches well, two inches or so. Supposed to keep three inches, but uh, yeah, that way you can use it again. So maybe I should. I measured 12 inches for this bag. Um, I might for the next bag add another inch or so, and that should be it. Um, you guys have a good one. I hope you enjoyed this video, and. If you're looking for, if you're looking to save food and store food and keep it fresh and, uh, you know, definitely worth the investment for sure. So, uh, you guys take care and have a good one.